Dear America, every 28 hours, a black person is killed in this country by police or vigilantes. A country that takes great pride in its racial progress since enslaving an entire group of people based upon the color of their skin. Dear America, you have strategically coined the term post-racial to describe your society because you so desperately want to remove yourself from the shame of your history. Yet the country is still governed by mass incarceration, housing segregation, education inequality, discriminatory employment practices, and massive racial economic disparities. A society plagued by fear and the subsequent policing of black bodies. A society where black skin is probable cause. Dear America, you will do anything to pardon yourself. You try to change the conversation, point the finger at the looters, black and black crime, choosing to ignore the looting of black lives and the irreparable damage done to thousands of black families. You call us thugs, savages, welfare queens, when what you really want to say is niggers. Dear America, an institution that holds so little regard for black lives cannot stand any longer. We need to hold our police to a higher standard as they are tasked with protecting and serving our communities. But who do they really protect and serve? Not Oscar Grant, not Tariqa Wilson, not Irvin Jefferson, not Tamir Rice, not Mekhi Gurley, not Michael Brown, not Trayvon Martin, not John Crawford, not Eric Garner, not Yvette Smith, not Kamani Gray, not Ramali Graham, and not Walter Scott. These are just a few of the countless black men and women who have died at the hands of police and vigilantes as a direct result of the color of their skin. Can you call this progress?